Yeah. <laughs> oh my god, I can't sit here all day and scratch you. I gotta make a video. Yeah, I gotta make a video. Hi, I'm Tuni from Mini Bowl Design, and today I want to talk about the uh, proto that I'm working on. Uh, now, I built this, and I fudged around and finally found a place that had 8 inch copper. So when I get done this video, I'll probably muff around and see if I can put this together and make a working stove out of it. So I just want to talk about this general concept for a few minutes, and I wrote my thoughts down here because I'm getting old and I can't remember. Okay, uh, I got quite a few emails and comments on the last video, and uh, some somebody said that, and they were correct, that uh, the design's been around a really long time. Uh, they're not very hot. You can buy one on eBay for eight bucks, and they're pretty heavy. Okay, if you take all that criteria there, you probably would just say, "Well, why do I even bother with this?" That's, and but my mind doesn't work that way. Here's how my mind works. Okay, these are always everyone I've seen so far is really heavy. I, I bought one off eBay. It hasn't, you know, it's on its way in the mail, and it's made out of steel, so you know it's heavy. But I think I can use it to backward engineer this one and eventually a smaller and lighter one. So I guess the question is, do they have to be heavy? I, I can't think of any reason why they do. I saw somebody make one out of a soda can, so I don't think they have to be heavy. Uh, everyone I've ever seen has one coil. Can you use two coils, three coils, four coils? I don't see why not, but maybe not. Uh, can they be scaled up to a fairly big unit? I've seen some pretty good size ones on YouTube, pretty good size, using 3 8 cop tubing. Uh, can you burn Coleman fuel? Can you burn isopropyl? I think I saw uh, R. Burgess uh, using one with Coleman fuel in it. He sent me a video response, so that, you know, that, that in itself is interesting. Could you use one coil to heat the alcohol and another set of jets to cook on? Don't know, never seen that. Uh, do they work in cold weather? How are they in the wind? And why do they all have really small fuel tanks? Is there a limit to how much fuel you can heat using this concept? So you see, if you take all these questions and think about it, maybe the answer to all of these is no. You can't scale it up. No, you can't make it hotter. No, you can't use two coils. And maybe it's totally useless. But until I see somebody do it and answer my questions, which I haven't, I'm going to start experimenting with it. And my end result that I'm shooting for is one of these with high volume, high heat, multi-coil, very lightweight. So it gives me something to play with. And I don't see anybody else doing it. So uh, I'm Tinny from Mini Bull Design. Get out and hike, take a friend, enjoy the great outdoors, and more important than anything, just enjoy your alcohol stoves, enjoy your hammock, just enjoy the sport, try to have a really great day. Bye-bye.